the Dern Rohr power plant is being rebuilt and equipped with a gigantic boiler. Prangle successfully completed the cross-discipline, high-caliber project after almost a year's planning time. A 140-ton boiler had to be shipped, transported, unloaded, and lifted in. The boiler has extraordinary measurements of 16 meters in length, 9 meters in height, and 6 meters in width, and had to be turned and laid on the sidewall for transport before loading in Serbia. The load arrived at the former Sventendorf nuclear power plant by river barge. Due to a missing key wall, the barge could not dock directly at the bank, which required the unloading crane to have a long range. Using a 400-ton crawler crane, it was possible to lift the boiler out of the water with a radius of 24 meters. The crawler crane weighed in at 530 tons, without the load suspended from the hook. Due to this massive weight, it was necessary to statically verify all surfaces in advance. In addition, the shipping police cordoned off and monitored unloading. A 626 HP four-wheel drive tractor unit with a 16-axle heavy-duty module trailer took around four hours to cover the six-kilometer route. It was necessary to proceed with extreme caution at many points along the way. Lamps on the Sventendorf nuclear power station site had already been turned or removed to facilitate the process. Furthermore, part of the fence and the exit gate had to be disassembled. Due to the vast dimensions, the boiler is as large as a detached house. Trees were cleared from the transport route. Traffic signs had to be taken down, and traffic islands and bends had to be covered with carriageway slabs. It was even necessary to separately disassemble two bends. Because the safety distance to some power lines was not reached, these had to be additionally switched off before passing.
The next challenge was a pipeline route that got in the way at the boundary to the power plant. The 400-ton crawler crane was dismantled at the water's edge and reassembled in Dürnrohr within three days, where it was used to lift the 140-ton boiler carefully over the obstacle and drive 70 meters onto the power station site at the same time. During the next step, the load was turned again in tandem with an additional 250-ton telescopic crane before being finally lifted into position. To reduce the distance, the crawler crane plus load, total weight of 670 tons, moved towards the boiler house in order to lift the boiler into place with absolute precision. During this assignment, Prangle was not just entrusted with the complete logistical concept with shipping, unloading, transport, handling and lifting in, but also with all critical auxiliary tasks. As such, the ground in the power station was checked and the experts at Prangle were also responsible for setting up the crane parking area. 240 excavator mats made of highly robust wood were used for this. The special sling was also developed by our in-house engineering department. A specialist company then produced the relevant components. Of course, Prangle also provided all other additional equipment, such as telehandlers and articulating boom lifts. Pre-planning and a reliable professional are more important as project complexity increases. Prangle proved this once again in an impressive way during this assignment. Mm -hmm.